Hello everybody, Izumi here, and today's video is going to be a little bit different. Um, uh, basically just going to be talking the whole time, like a question and answer type thing about things that I get asked a lot on the game, and you know, some of it's personal questions and some of it has to do with the game. So we'll start off with just whichever one. So I get asked a lot about my name. Sailor Azumi. And yeah, I know it's a girl's name. It's a Japanese girl's name. And I've used that name for about 15 years, actually. Um, to be 100% honest, I ripped it off from a movie called Azumi, a Japanese movie. And it's about a girl in feudal Japan type thing who is really good with a sword. That's really all I'm going to say about it. I haven't seen it in a while, but that's what inspired me to use that name. And the sailor part came from Sailor Moon because that was one of my favorite shows as a little kid. And I actually have a huge tattoo of Sailor Moon on my ribcage. So, I figured let's go with Sailor Azumi. I used to use other versions of Azumi, but I think the Sailor thing is going to be permanent now. So, that's why everything I do is Sailor Azumi. I used to go by Azumi Kuro, actually, which is just Azumi Black. So let's answer a couple of questions now about the collab that I've been asked. Um, am I going to pull for Valkyrie Asuka and Valkyrie Ray? Uh, the answer to that is, is I don't know. I don't have enough diamonds to really do it right now and it's not guaranteed and so I'm not sure if I'm going to do it or not. It just depends on what circumstances look like for me between now and then and whether I can do it or not is pretty much the answer to that so there really isn't an answer the, the answer is is that I don't know what I'm gonna do I have um, the main one I was really concerned with getting was Ray and I got her on the first guarantee and I did the other pulls just to get the other Ava characters to make the connect battle and stuff a little bit easier and that's one of my favorite shows. And I got the main three from the show. I got Rei, Shinji, and Asuka. And that's really all that I wanted anyway. Mari wasn't in the original anime. So I don't really have as much of a, a nostalgic attachment to her as I do the other characters. Because she wasn't in it. But other than that. I don't. Ri I probably will end up not pulling for him. Honestly, that's what I can say. Unless I somehow get, I don't know. I need about what six, seven thousand diamonds right now to do three pulls to make it worth it. To do it for a video, then I would do it. But I don't have enough right now, so it's not really in my best interest to do it. And I've gotten so lucky lately, like, I, I wouldn't believe it if I actually got lucky again and got one of them. I'd probably end up having to save up the tokens, so... I would say chances are, no, I'm not gonna pull for Valkyrie Ray and Valkyrie Asuka, unless I get a lot of diamonds accidentally, and that doesn't happen. <laughs> okay, so let's go on to another question. How long have I been playing the game? Um... I've been playing the game since the Fate collab came out. That's what made me join this. Uh, I like the Fate anime, so I saw this come up on my recommendations actually on Facebook. And I decided to try it, and I liked it. Now, this account that I use now is not the account that I used when I played with the Fate characters. I, I have two different accounts. I, I have... The account where I have all my Fate characters, and then I have the account where I re-rolled for the Miku collaboration, and I ended up sticking with the characters with the Miku collaboration, which this is the account that I normally play with. 
So that's that's the answer to that pretty much. Um, another one that people like to ask me about is emulators and why there happens to be a mouse pointer on my videos. There's a good reason for that. But there's a short answer and there's a long answer. The short answer is, is no, I don't really use an emulator at all. And I will show you my setup in a second after after this fight concludes because I have to, you know, I'm going to have to cut that in because I'm going to have to use a regular camera instead of recording off of my phone. But, um, yeah, basically I play this game because I love anime. I love, I like the art style of the characters. Um, not even going to lie, I, I like the way that they draw the girls in the game. And I like the way that the combat system works. To me, it's... I, I like grinding. That's the kind of games that I like to play. And I don't always have time to sit and play, you know, like every Kinect Battle or every fight on manual. That's So I tend to like a game that has an auto feature. And then there's enough to this game to where I can keep, you know, like the Super Connects and stuff like that. That forced me to have to keep changing and not use the same characters all the time. But to me, it's just a fun game, and I like, you know, out of the out of the different gotcha games that I've played, this is one of the better ones. You know, you don't have to necessarily get do super good in your pools or spend a whole lot of money to be able to do well in this game. I mean. I do have a couple of OP characters, but for the most part, in Arena, I have done, I'm in group 19, the highest I've made it to, I think, is rank 16, which is him, um, with, this is just my defense team, I don't really care if you see that, but, uh, I made it that far with mostly non-Star Party and Moon Party characters. Ma mo mostly with Awakened characters is how I made it that far. And just being smart with my gear sets. That's really what it boils down to. Making use of this mana to get what I need from the different trader shops. And taking advantage of the economy that this game has. And that's pretty much it. So we'll... Instead of going off on a tangent, let's go show you my setup. So give me one second. I'm going to have to transition here a little bit and set up a camera and everything. So I will be right back. Okay, welcome back. So this is basically my setup right here. My full screen computer and here's how I play Valkyrie Connect. So I have a mouse here. It's going to be hard to see. There's I, I do play in terrible lighting. I have a mouse. This is a... I'll just read it. An M, a Logitech MX Master Mouse. So let it poke it back in. It will work on my computer, as you can see over here on this screen. Hey, why'd it stop moving? Anyway, supposed to be pedals blowing here. There we go. I think it was just waiting on me to say that. So then what I do is then I take and I flip it over. And I change this to two. Now, well, I don't know how good this is going to be. It's probably going to be a lot of glare. Because I don't record like this. Now, see, the mouse on my computer screen is not moving anymore. But now it's moving on. 
the device. Let it load here. See down here in the corner of the mouse moving? That's the same mouse. Except for I've got so much glare. I knew this wasn't going to turn out very good, but I get asked this question a lot about emulators and such. But as you can see, all you really need is a phone with a Bluetooth mouse. Now, see, it looks a lot better because I actually record the screen of my phone. And I'll tell you what it is. This is a Galaxy Active S8. And, and I even plug my... Um, Here's my microphone. This is the microphone that I use. It is a snowball, one of the blue snowballs. And I take this little handy thing right here, plug that into my phone, and then I can plug my microphone into my phone as well. And yeah, you're getting a good look at my my walls, my pictures on my wall here. And that's basically how that goes. I can plug my microphone, which is right here, into my into my phone. I have a Bluetooth mouse, and it makes it pretty easy to play that way. I set my phone on the wireless charger that I have and pull it up real close and use my mouse, and it works great that way. So that should answer the emulator question. I don't really use one because I don't really need to. The, the only plus for me for an emulator was being able to use a mouse. And because I can use one on my phone, I really don't need to use an emulator a whole lot. So, I don't cheat gems into the game and I'm guessing that's why a team banned emulators or, you know, want to discourage people from using them. Which I can completely understand that. Um... And one more thing just for the heck of it. Because of the collab, I have my... Let's see if it'll focus. My Asuka and Rey uh, mermaid figures sitting here on top of my computer. So, yep, that's pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to show people how I play the game and answer a couple of questions that I get asked. So... Um, yeah, this was a different kind of video for me. Uh, if you like this kind of thing, ask me questions and I'll answer them, no problem. Um, thank you for watching this and have a good day.